Hello everyone, let's start with question number 10. So it says if one of the zeros of a quadratic polynomial of the form x square plus ax plus b is the negative of the other, then it. So these are the options given to us. Out of these four, we need to find the answer for it. So in this case, it says that one of the zeros, that is beta, equals negative of the other, that is minus alpha. So this is given to us. So now the formula uh, to known is alpha plus beta that is sum of zeros equal minus b over a. Now the other one is alpha dot beta which equals c over a that is the product of zeros equals c over a in this case. Now in the given quadratic polynomial we are given with x square plus ax plus b. So b in this case is a that will be minus a and a in this case is 1 so it will be minus a. Alpha plus beta is minus a. Now we need to find alpha dot beta. So alpha dot beta is c over a. So C in this case is B and A in this case is 1. So alpha dot beta is B. Now in this case we know that alpha plus beta is minus A and alpha dot beta is B. Now on the left hand side we know that beta equals minus alpha. So it will be alpha. Beta can be replaced with minus alpha. So plus minus alpha, alpha minus alpha is 0, equal minus a. So from this equation we get that a equals 0. Now solving this part that is alpha dot beta. Alpha dot beta will be alpha, beta can be replaced with minus alpha. So it will be minus alpha square. So minus alpha square equal b. That means my b is lesser than 0. If it is lesser than 0 then b must be negative. So if b is negative we get solution as fx a is 0 x square plus 0x b is negative. So I get x square minus b. So so it will be, it shows that it has no linear term. So therefore it has no linear term in this case. And the option right is A part that it has no linear term and the constant term is negative. Constant term is the third one and it is negative. So in this case the right option is has no linear term and the constant term is negative. Linear term is the second one. So you can see that it is missing from here. It is 0. So therefore has no linear term here.